Criminals are targeting cars, heisting catalytic converters. Metro police say it's an issue businesses in Madison are battling. And in this crime tracker alert, News 2's Stephanie Langston spoke with one of the victims who lives on Myatt Drive and shows us the evidence those thieves left behind. Yeah, Dunlop and Kyle Tire Company has been hit twice within just a matter of days, and they believe by the same suspects. This possibly one of the ways they're gaining entry. Their actions all caught on camera. The thieves struck at 7.30 last Friday night and again early Monday morning. Both times they were chased off by employees, but Adam Waldrop says they still made off with four catalytic converters from their delivery trucks. It's very upsetting. You know, we're trying to run a business here, and uh, when that happens, we can't run our routes. And, you know, on a typical stop, we may have 15 customers. So those 15 people are not getting their time. It, it, it snowballs. You know, it's not just an inconvenience for us. It's for our customers and, and then the end user. Um, so there's a lot of people here it's affecting, and that's just this one business. At least four other businesses in the area have reached out to Waldrop, also victims. Employees of the tire company even finding some of the stolen property in the woods near the railroad tracks. That's where we found the duffel bag full of catalytic converters. Seven catalytic converters were in the bag, but the thieves still got away with the parts to their trucks, as well as a number of large tires. They, they got six or eight um, truck tires, spare tires. Bold act that businesses like this are fed up with. And they are offering up a cash reward for information that leads to an arrest and conviction of those thieves. Reporting from Madison, Stephanie Langston, News 2. Now, Metro Police tell News 2 they have made an arrest they believe may be related to the thefts in the Madison area.